started 1995 and uh, I wanted to start because of the action movies but also my father he's a uh, ex military and uh, at that time Sikhan Popov was a uh, instructor in the army and he knew about him and I also wanted to to train something with full contact, not a point. And uh, this year's Sigan Popov's dojo was really famous in the city, big, so I started there. <laughs> no, not something particular. Maybe the first time I I went on a world championship, it was really something new, something big. But I think every, every fight is special for you because uh, it's, every fight is different and it takes a little part from you. It doesn't matter if you win or lose, but uh, just being there and uh, trying to find solution with your opponent it takes something from you and that's why every fight is special well there are some guys from the young generation who are really talented and i hope they will be no valery dimitrov but better <laughs> and maybe it will take a lot of time but still I want to believe in that. I think uh, in karate everyone can be a champion. If you look at the world champions we have, we have uh, the smallest guy world champion, we have big guys like Tsukagoshi, we have very technical champions. So as long as you listen to your body and understand your strong and weak sides and improve, I believe that anyone can be a champion. No, I think uh, most of the champions are really different from each other. It's not like... And this is very nice because every champion is a different personality, different way of using his body and this way our karate is getting more colorful, more interesting and better, I think. Imagine if all champions are the same, this will be very boring. Uh, I'm, I'm a little bit nostalgic from the old days because you can <clears throat> use more techniques and the fight looks more beautiful to watch. Now it's more physical, lots of conditioning and uh, people are not very amused from the fights. And, uh, mm. But I think it's our responsibilities, the fighters' responsibilities, even with that to find, uh, to improve and make the fight look better, even for someone who doesn't understand. Uh, because, of course, we all want to win, but uh, if we want to win, but in a better way, in a special way, then everyone will benefit from that. Well, I try to follow, yes, UFC, boxing, and yeah, mainly this martial arts, sometimes grappling, but uh, no, not every week. I'm, I'm not a super fan or something, but I enjoy some of the fighters and uh, I think in MMA they went really deep because it's professional sport. There's a lot of money, lots of coaches and they level up very quickly. For karate we do six, more than 50 years and they started like 93, that's less than 30, no, 30 years and they're so ahead because of this and I think there are lots of uh, things we can take from them because many martial arts go in, in there and try to compete and different styles it, 
it's I think it's valuable. <laughs>